frightening. Sum it up in one word, frightening. I feel really sorry for all the French and you know for everybody in Europe really. Obviously it's an incredibly, incredibly sad time. It's an international travesty. I think it's atrocious. I mean I don't think any words can explain what's happened there and how those people must be feeling. Very sad, you know, I mean, it's, it's, but it's all over the world. I felt sympathy. Paris is it's close to Jersey. The thought that it's getting closer to home uh, has got to be a concern to everybody. It's been an absolute tragedy. Um, you know, it seems to be coming closer to home. You know, it's, um, it's quite scary. I knew Jersey people that had gone over for the weekend, but they were fine, thank God. It's an enormous thing that's happened, which is going to affect a lot of people. Don't give up on life, uh, life has to carry on. Well, just to say that we're all thinking of them and um, you know, just to, um, to keep strong, and don't give in and just carry on living. That's the message. Hope and peace, that's all we need. I hope that all, all the world, not just Europe, all the world can find a way to end this. Um, I've seen the Facebook pictures with the red, white and blue, which I think is fantastic. Like it to happen to anybody. Carry on, you know, we can't give in to this and you know, we just need to live our lives. No, all I can really say is that my thoughts go out to all the Parisians who are currently going through this event.